Okay. Welcome back to the vlog. Today is a very exciting day for me, especially because we get to hook up the RDR8. -R it's a long time coming. I've been ordering parts for this thing for the last couple of months, for about six months now, and finally everything arrived. Let me show you what we have. We have the very nice looking wheels, the RFX 10s from Rohana. They're 20 inch wheels. Of course, wrapped around with some Falcon tires, which you guys know Falcon and us, we get along very, very well, and they have the best tires in the market, in my opinion. So we got those things in here, which is the same tires that I had on my uh, Kia, and they perform outstanding. Moving along, we have a stud and not kid, because as we all know, European oh, cars. Right? You call me? Stud? Nobody calls oh, me. Call me as a nut kid. <laughs> 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 Anyways, we're gonna be throwing these things on so they can make everything so much easier putting the wheels in and out. Down here we have a bunch of APR stuff. Our oh, boys, I see a big wing it's, here. It's a big wing. So for this car, they make two types of wing. They make the 71 inch and they make the 74 inch. The 74 inch is full when you have the little wide body in the back. Obviously, I'm not going that route. So I got the 71 inch surfboard. <laughs> So this thing, the best thing about this wing is that it's a chassis mount wing and everything that you need comes with the item. You have the uh, plates, the mount, the bolts, everything that you need, it, it comes with it to include instructions. We have the side skirts from APR as well. We also have the trunk. And as you notice with the trunk, it already comes pre-cut. So this trunk can only be run with their wing, basically? Is that right? Yeah. So, okay. so you have an option to buy the trunk without the pre-cut section if you just want to replace the trunk lid with a carbon fiber one. Or um, unless you want to cut your own trunk, which is fine, but I'd rather not cut my, my original trunk. Uh, so we, we ended up buying this for a couple of hundred dollars uh, and it already comes pre-cut for the wing. We have carbon fiber canards for the front bumper. And I just purchased this somewhere online. I don't remember where, but I got them a long time ago. We have the front lid from APR as well. And this thing looks gnarly. The one, the one thing you show me underneath, can you flip it? Oh yeah. It comes with steel plates at the bottom of the lip. That way you don't destroy your lip. It's pretty it's smart. Steel. It's like riveted in, just a piece it of uh, steel or aluminum, I don't know. I can't tell. And they're kind of placed, and you won't, you can't notice that at all when it's yeah. on the ground, obviously, because it's so low. But yeah, maybe maybe we can give this to Victor and, and maybe, uh, <laughs> maybe you, he'll save a lip. Let's just say this, you get what you pay for. All right, so now that you're seeing all the parts that I'm gonna be throwing in this car, let's get to work. Ricky, where'd you get that merch, dude? Woo, check this out. Some new merch? You can go to the link description below. Go to throttle.com and pick it up. Let's go. Let me see that back. Let me see that. Woo, baby. Feel like a race team. See, that's why the Lord equipped this man with these big ass thumbs. The Lord? <laughs> yeah, so he could get clips like that. I, I just, these little thumbs don't do it. So right now I'm taking off, um, not removing the side skirts, but I'm unbolting the bottom of the side skirt. Uh, I also gotta take the wheel wells out of the, uh, the corners, so I'm able to uh, push down on the side skirt itself. That way when the APS side screw goes in here, I'm able to bolt it down from the inside. What the instructions said, so that's what I'm doing. So I want to interrupt this video to remind you of our contest going on right now. It is Throttle Dream Build 1. And what it is, is us grabbing your personal car and turning it into something really cool and fancy. If you guys want to have your personal project built by us here at Throttle, just go to the link description below and check out all the information. There is only a couple of days left since the contest ends on August 31st, which is just a couple of days from now. So please don't wait, go to the link description below, follow the instructions, and let us build your car. Down stars to save the day. Those rocket extensions look way wider than what I thought they were gonna be. Dude, but I love it, man. 
I've seen uh, I just I've seen a lot of exotics here get built, on t especially on TGSI when they do carbon fiber lips or side skirts. They literally just show this much, and for you to actually see this whole thing, it's amazing. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Damn, those look sick though. Is that? It's like a. It's preset. You can't put right. it in or out. No, it's preset. Yeah. Dude, this is gonna on. be aggressive. Yeah. I'm gonna grab a marker. I'm gonna get down there. I'm gonna mark some stuff that needs to be marked. Draw some three eighth of an inch holes, I believe it is. And we'll uh, bolt everything down. She ain't going nowhere. No faith. We'll one see. day, one day. He's gonna come back tomorrow, he's gonna be messed up. Side skirts and all. It's gonna be right here. You're gonna see it. Little, right. little carbon flakes. No faith no whatsoever. Yeah. What are we doing here, Quinn? Putting wheel studs in instead of the lug bolts. That's it. We are going to take this thing apart and this thing apart because we are putting a carbon fiber trunk lid and we are gonna start mounting the wing, which requires wing mounts, which requires cutting and smoking some holes. Hey, bud. And these, you gonna go surfing? You just got a surfboard strapped inside of the car? Ask, but I'm gonna take lots of pictures. Taking surfing lessons? Looks like it, where's this wing? The wing? Over there. It's pretty nice, it's a cool shape. So right now we're making lines. We're gonna draw some lines. So we're literally following the instructions that APR provides. And we're doing five and a quarter from the left side of the panel to the right. And we're doing nine and a half inches from the bottom side up. And we need to cut that off because that is where our chassis mount plate is gonna be sitting. See, and that's the base plate. That's what we're doing. Do it, teacher. Do it, dude. Oh. Creep, dude. What a creep. I just got done making more holes. Next, I'm going to rip nut the chassis. <laughs> One down. Three more to go. Great success. So this piece is like independent. Oh yeah, it just has a bunch of bolts. That's cool. So they put like a exoskeleton of the hatch and this plate just like bolts to it. Because Ricky bought a replacement piece that's carbon fiber and is already trimmed out for the wing. I'm just glad we don't have to mess with any of this stuff. Just unbolt it from there and we're done. Sick.
So I don't know exactly where these are gonna fall. Cause this section right here is cut out for the wing mounts to stick up. So like, I don't know if we need to move it back or forward or left or right or how this is all gonna work out. So it's super easy to just pop that panel back on when we're done. So I think we're just gonna leave it loose. And when Ricky finishes putting his wing mounts on, then we'll kind of check where we're gonna sit as far as fitment goes when we bring it down. And we can make our adjustments and lock it down. Just waiting on slow boy Ricky. So right now I have the uh, chassis mount plate installed and then this is one of the wing mounts that goes on the side of it and it gets bolted out from the bottom. So that's already done. And I'm just mocking everything right now and then afterwards I'm just gonna take everything out and put some block tight in it just to make sure these things don't come out. But so far so good, everything is going in fine. Pretty much just test fitting everything. I lift the bolts. Can you hold this? So this is the only wing that I've noticed that's in the market for R8s that lets you use your factory wing full function. Most of them you have to disconnect this because usually wings go on top of this wing. This is the only mount that allows you to keep both systems at the same time. R Ricky up and left, you got other things to do than hold this. Let me go get these bolts. Hold this. Here I am. Let me see if I can get the bolts. Thank you, sir. Get a couple of start in here. So when you close this, it's supposed to miss this? Yeah. Bring it down. Oh yeah, here you go. Look at oh. that. Woo! Perfect. We just finished mounting the wing mounts. We're gonna test the power on it. And it clears. Now that it clears, we're gonna tighten everything back up. level and as you adjust the wing you can adjust this to stay level because right now obviously it's not level but if you do this isn't that crazy mm -hmm. APR thought of everything cool first things first Time for the wheels. It is time. Let's see if Evan Spec got the right specs. Different car, baby. That is so sick. Sick. Really nice. From Rohana. This is the first set of Rohanas we put on. And I'm very impressed with the quality so far. The finish is really good. Uh, fitment looks really good. Obviously, we need to get it on the ground, but it's really aggressive. Gloss black. The gloss black is the way to go for this, this particular car. What a, what a transformation. One video transformation. One day, a few hours. It was, uh, APR made it very, very easy to put this on. The instructions were super easy to follow and everything fit perfect. There was no trimming needed for this thing to go in.
Let's go. Dang, that thing is so sick. It's a totally different car now. Canards, I love the canards. Front lift is good. Side is good. Dang. Woo! Wow, dude. That looks sick. I almost want you to lower it just a little bit, but I know I know you don't want to touch the suspension because the car is so good. Yeah, I do not want to touch the suspension. Dude. It totally looks like a DTM like it Le Mans does. car, dude. That thing looks so sick. All right, so as you can see, you guys see the front lid, tire skirts, and the big wing from APR. Everything fit perfectly. We have the canals which I sourced on the internet. The front headlights and the whole front end it has PPF from Tin World. Of course, the Rohana RFX wheels, RFX 10 wheels, with the Falcon tires. You can pretty much find everything you see here on our website. If you go to throttle.com, if you have an RA, you can literally outsource everything through our website. On top of that, um, the calipers, which I, I don't think I mentioned, but I painted them on my uh, in my house before I even got here. So that was done. Uh, and don't forget guys, like this is something that, if you would've told me a year ago I would've had an RA, I would've said you're crazy. I just went out and got one and I'm lucky and blessed enough that now I'm able to afford it. And just to have the add-ons that I just did to the car is pretty much insane. I still can't believe it. So, chase your dreams, what I'm trying to say. Don't stop. And like TJ said, keep moving forward. Or just gotta want it. So that's it, guys, for this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much. And let me know what I should do next to my RA. See ya.